Welcome back to Cleveland on the Rocks, Eliza and Burn Bar. And I'm Matt, and that's Roger. And Roger bought a super cool bottle from Jack Daniels, the number 27 gold, maple finished. Woo! Welcome back, guys. So, we got our super cool bottle that Roger brought us over here today. And this is the Jack Daniels number 27 gold maple wood finish. So, what is so special about this bottle, Roger? I feel like this is like the coolest bottle that I've seen on your shelf here. And I feel like you got a giant cool story behind this. All right, so this is a specific bottle that they only sell in general and distribution. That's one of the harder ones I've seen, come across to find. Um, I actually tried to get it directly from the distillery when we did the uh, bourbon tour down there. When we did the the angels, the tastings down yeah, there, yeah, oh, yeah, did the, did the uh, tasting of the distillery, did the whole tour. Um, they were sold out of it, um, but luckily uh, my girlfriend was actually able to find it for me as a gift online and got it for me for my birthday. So yeah. we're gonna open it up and taste it and see what we got. Right? Thank you, young lady. Bah! Because that's a super cool bottle. So this one is forty percent, eighty proof, and we're gonna tell you guys what it tastes like here. You want to crack this one, Roger? Or sure. You kidding? Yeah, why don't you crack that? That was his birthday present. I don't want to kind of like step in on him here, you know. Plus, he has longer nails than I do, so I figured he'd have an easier time opening it. I think you're wrong. <laughs> they still have dirt just like mine do, working on cars, huh? Cars, motorcycles, <laughs> everything else. All right, you ready? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Ooh, smells sweet. Ooh, that smells, smells good. good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That smells sweeter than a normal Jack Daniels that I'm used to smelling, so I'm like, all right, all right. Look at that. You know what that looks like to me? Honey. Honey. And I'm really hoping it tastes like maple. That'd be killer. All right. Thank you, brother. This is a really cool bottle. I've seen this bottle in person one time, and obviously this is the second time. I've seen it on the shelf, but I've never seen it with the super cool box. Roger was like, man, I got it in the box. And I'm like, what box? You show me the box, I'm like, dude, that's super cool. So I'm really, really hyped for this. I, I got lots of stuff in boxes for some reason. You do? Yeah. <laughs> you have a lot of boxes in your case there. I'm like, how's he got all these crazy cool boxes? I've never seen these boxes before. But hell yeah. So this one has your natural jack kick on it. You have like a almost banana undertone. A little banana, to it. vanilla. Mm -hmm. A little bit of a. And almost like a little bit of graham cracker and pepper at the end there. Yeah, I mean, you definitely smell the maple though too. Mm hmm It smells sweeter. It doesn't have that like Jack Seven flavor to it. No, Thank God, because I was no, like, it, I'm, I was hoping. Honestly, it smells probably closer to the like the Sinatra Select. Yes, yeah. I would give you that because that's a good bottle. Yeah, I had one for a minute. <laughs> I think I traded it for something. <laughs> I still got half a bottle left. Do you? Yeah. We should do a video. We never did a video on mine. <laughs> I traded mine before we got to because I think I was looking for something like super hardcore and I traded for it. And I'm like, damn. Really cool bottle. Really cool story behind it. We'll do a video on that. But the maple one, <laughs> we're going to stay on, on topic here. I'm, I'm, I'm getting this off topic here. <laughs> this, is, this smells really good. It does. You ready? Yeah. Cheers, bro. Cheers to you guys out there. Oh, what the hell? That's way different. Very smooth. Real mellow. It's almost like honey and maple. And then, oh, yeah. you have it at the end. Okay. So your wood comes through at the end. Yep. You do get that, like, uh, it's almost like a, it's not pine. It's like a, almost like a cedar-ish kind of taste in there. Have you ever had, what were the ones that we had that were finished six times in six different woods? I had a drink that was obscenely different woods. This has that kick at the end. I love it. I think it's fantastic. Yeah. Very sweet up front, and then you get the wood tannins at the back, and it's. I think this is fantastic. Yeah, that's actually it's really good. A lot of very smooth finish to it, like you said. You got that. It does this? This is yeah. It starts off. It's almost like a. And I don't get the banana taste that I'm so used to. No. And I'm so used to Jack Daniels and banana, and it's there's none there. Like it's not. It's all like maple vanilla. -y. That's really good. I'm gonna have to get one of these. It's really smooth, really mellow. I mean, you don't get that classic afterburn either. It's just real, it goes down so easy. It does. It has a different taste at the end that I can't put my finger on what it is, but it's a it's a different finish at the back when it's going down your yeah, throat. It's, 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 a, it's good, it's smooth. 
it, you know, it's, it's honestly, when I get on the finish of it, it like you said, that it's that peppery finish. Mm -hmm. It's peppery, and then you get that little hint of like a smoked maple wood. Yeah. Actually, it's, you know what? That's probably what that yeah. is then. Yeah. That's good. That's really, really yeah. good. This is a fantastic bottle. So how much would this bottle run you if you found it at the store? Because I know what I've seen it in the stores at, but they're not in stores that are state regulated. So <laughs> I can tell you what I've seen it for. But I, I want to say it was around $100 at the distillery. Oh. I, I don't know. Okay. I don't know what she paid for it online. But she got the super probably. cool box and everything. <laughs> it was probably a little bit more than that. I've seen it for $129. Um, but it is what it is. We don't get it in Ohio. And we're in Ohio. We don't get that. So that's what it is. Very cool bottle. Jack Daniels has some really cool products out there. If you like Jack 7 or you don't, don't sway away from the other products they have because some of their stuff is like really freaking good and I feel like a lot of you guys would like it out there. So this one's not, this is, this is a fantastic one. Yeah. If you do see this one and it's under like a hundred bucks or so or around a hundred dollars, it's probably a good pickup. You should get that. You'll probably like it. So I, yeah, I definitely tried even if you're not a Jack Daniels person because like you said, it doesn't have that typical Jack kick. I know. I was waiting it's... for banana. I was. I'm like, maple and banana? That's going to be good. And I'm like, there's no banana. It's just maple. This is really freaking good. Yeah. So this is a fantastic one. I hope you guys are enjoying the reviews out there. And uh, if you're liking stuff by Jack Daniels, this man has a ton of different stuff that I haven't done yet. So we'll be doing a whole bunch of those because he's got a bunch of Jack Daniels type stuff. So get used to seeing Roger on here when you see Jack Daniels, right? That's what that is? Lucky them. <laughs> But I want to thank all you guys out there for watching. If you guys are out there and you're driving and you're somewhere at a bar, somewhere not at home, make sure you guys are not drinking and driving. Do that thing. Make sure you get home safe. Take an Uber. It's easier. And make sure you like, share, subscribe on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, all them things. We'll see you guys next time.